We live with it right now, man. Who we got on Futures TV? 26 AM, you know. That's what's up, man. You one of the hottest Brooklyn rappers right now, you know what I'm saying? Buzzing heavy. Whole bunch of videos over 100 k Man. Yeah, man. <laughs> like, why you think you buzzing like this right now, man? Like, people fucking with you so much. Why you think that is? Because they hear what I'm talking about. They believe it, bro. Yeah. They know. They already know what's up. Yeah. So let's take it back, though, man. Like, where where are you originally from, though? I'm from Crown Heights, Bergen and Ocean. Yeah. So what was your childhood like when you was coming up? I was coming up. I still was regular, like. The hoe always been crazy though, but niggas always getting indicted and shit like that. Yeah. That shit. Shit right though. Was you into like any sports? Yeah, I was playing ball. I be playing ball, I'm nice. Yeah. yeah. Most the favorite player? Kyrie. Yeah. Kyrie? Yeah. Uh, he ain't fucking with John Wall though, man. <laughs> That's the homie. Nah, yeah, 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 those niggas. Yeah. Kyrie though, man. Yeah, so like, what, I mean, what did you think you would do? What you thought you would be doing before this music stuff? I thought I was going to play ball forever. Yeah. Next, I thought I was going to go to the league. Facts. Yeah. So when did the music thing, like, start taking off, though, man? Like, what made you want to get in that lane? When I got booked, I got indicted, bro. I got yeah. to a gang in 2016. Mm -hmm. At, like, 2017, 2018. I was hearing from when I was in jail that niggas is rapping and shit. Niggas is dissing us and shit, bro. Niggas yeah. wait till we got indicted and shit, though. I mean, so from there, I started hearing that. And I'm hearing niggas getting lit, so I just started rapping while I was in jail and shit. Facts. Yeah. What, what was that whole experience like, man, when you was, you know, in the joint? Because I feel like people paint a picture of how it is. Like, people, yeah. you know. Um, so, like, how, how was your experience? For me. I was good in it, but mentally that shit fucked me up, though. But, right. for me, I was good, because I'm a gangster, for me, I'm not gonna let nobody play with me, shit like that, for me. Yeah. But that shit hard mentally, that shit fuck up your trust and all that, you Yeah. Gangster, though. So how long you was in there for? For four years. Four years, yeah. Though? Damn, bro. Yeah. So what, was you, like, you was getting a lot of fights and stuff in there? Or you were just yeah. like... I was down in trouble in there. Word. I was down in trouble, I ain't gonna lie. I, I, I get bored and shit. Yeah. Start trouble and shit. I was doing that shit, but ain't nobody really playing with me. Yeah. So, you know what I'm saying? You you come home, you know what I'm saying? The first song that you put out when you got when you came home. Yeah, Aaron Rodgers. Yeah. Yeah. That's what's up, man. That's what's up. So, what, like, it's a thousand rappers coming out of Brooklyn, you feel me? What you think going, like, make you... So what do you think you the special one that's going to, you know, take I off in this out. shit? Because niggas be cabin, niggas <laughs> be pussy, niggas be riding. And like, I don't know, I just be talking my shit. I be, I be talking different shit from niggas, yeah. I feel like. What's your whole process be like when you be, you know what I'm saying, coming up with your songs? I be getting inspired from different shit. Like, I hear other music, I get inspired and shit like that. That's how I help write my shit. Yeah. Or something to happen. Some real life shit happen. That shit, that shit inspired me too. Word. Now, now I see that you was on Talk of the Town top 10 freshman list, man. How that shit felt? Man, shout out to Talk of the Town. That shit was a good feeling. I'm being acknowledged, bro. I appreciate that. Yeah, man. So, you know, it's a, it's a lot of rappers in Brooklyn, like I just said, man. Who you, you know what I'm saying, you want to work with, though, man? In Brooklyn? Yeah, in Brooklyn. I don't know. I fuck with whoever fuck with me. I got a lot of ops. I'm, I'm everybody K. I don't know. Yeah. I fuck with who fuck with me, though. Yeah. Why, why you think you got... I don't got, work with nobody. Why you think you got so many, you know what I'm saying, enemies and shit, bro? I'm saying. Niggas envy. Niggas be dissing low-key. They be dissing and shit. I don't like that shit. Yeah. Hey, when we got locked up, everybody was just dissing niggas. They don't even know what's me. Yeah. I don't like that shit. So from your side, like, what, what's, you know what I'm saying? What is it? It's mostly like, like, Bloods, Crips, or, you mm. know, you don't want to talk about it. It's eight, like, it's all that like shit. Just like every other neighborhood, it's all that like shit, man. Yeah. How the, um, you know what I'm saying? When you be out and shit, like, how the, how the fans be treating you, like, the youth and shit? I know the kids look up to you, I know. Yeah. They be showing love, they be seeing me going crazy and shit. 
like that shit. Yeah, man. So, well, I mean, where do you see yourself at in five years? In five years? Yeah. I'm beyond in five years. I'm beyond. I'm be up there. Most definitely, man. So, you know, with this, with this music thing, like, how you feel about, like, um, people that be, you know, rapping about a lifestyle or, you know, dissing just to get, you know, for caught? Because I feel like those diss songs, they get a lot of numbers, you feel me? Yeah. So, like, how you be feeling about all that? Saying you could do that, you could you could rap that gangster shit for clout, but don't be dissing niggas. You know you not on that time with for me like yeah. that spot. You know you not crazy. Like, I don't like that shit. You be doing that shit for clout. Shit. Yeah. So how how do you feel about like the whole Brooklyn hip hop scene right now? The whole Brooklyn shit like yeah. Brooklyn going up. I like that shit. The spotlight on Brooklyn. That let me know I got a chance for me. Yeah. Most definitely, man. So what you got coming out next? Coming out next? Yeah. My son Nigo just came on to the song Nigo. Go ask Grant. Yeah. We about to go crazy. You feel me? And I got a project coming soon. And I got mad songs. I got mad shit. Okay. Okay. That's what's up, man. Um, uh, so what else can, the, you know, the streets be expecting now? I'm saying. They just gonna keep getting hit. I'm gonna keep going crazy till I get home. That's what I'm gonna keep doing. Most definitely. Shit like that. Yeah, are you signed right now, man? Huh? Are you signed right now? Nah, I'm independent. Okay, so how, how much would you need to sign? Like, a couple amps, two, three amps, bro. Nothing less than that? Nah, less. I ain't yeah. going for that. We running through that right now. Fuck that shit. Yeah. The um the mindset joint that joint at three hundred k more than three hundred k man. Yeah. Did you know that song was gonna be as big as it was? Nah, I ain't feel like that. I just thought it was just another song I'm driving bro. But that shit going crazy. Bro. Yeah man, that's what it is, bro. Yeah. I see you got songs with Siggy Black too, man. Like what was it like linking up with him? Man, mm -hmm. how, how did it come about? That's gang though. We got mob ties. What's that? The uh, two six oh five man. So so five, that's yeah. mm, look it up. We been lit before that indictment, bro. Before we got indicted in twenty sixteen, we was lit. Then we got indicted. Fuck me in the stone cloud, but we ain't gonna talk about that, bro. Yeah. Shit like that. But Tazo B go crazy, Rocko Boy. Yeah, that's game. Right. Go. That's two six right there. So they they're trying to book you for a show. Even though I know it's the pandemic right now, you know what I'm saying? But nah, yeah. for like features and all that, man, like where can they get at you at, bro? Um, underscore A, I'll go with J.R. on the gram. That's, that's my gram. You hit me on the gram. I'll get with you. Or you hit my manager, you heard? Yeah. What's this shit again? Bando Keys. Mm -hmm. Bando yeah. Keys on the gram. Okay. Sure. And, you know, lately I've been seeing Brooklyn a lot on the news, bro. It's like. It's like that Chicago shit. or some shit, man. That shit out of right now. Yeah, do do you feel like Brooklyn was worse back then when you was coming up, or you feel like it's it's worse now? Nah, that shit reckless right now. They got lit. Yeah. I'm staying out of it. Don't keep me out of that shit. Oh, I don't got nothing to do with that shit. <laughs>